What's going on, America? This is Kevin in Kevin's Corner once again. Uh, check it out. My man Hank Johnson is crying uncle. Right now, Diamond and Silk got him in the chicken wing. They got him in the uh, full Nelson. They got him in the Bob Backlund chicken wing. They're hitting him with the Jimmy Superfly Snooker. They're hitting him with the George the Animal Steel or Iron Mike. Yeah, they hit me with all of that. They hit me with the Andre the Giant. They just, the man, the man right now is like, no moss, no moss. He's tapping, he's tapping. You know why? Because he brought it on himself, see? He the one want to jump in the ring, thinking he was going to beat up on Diamond and Silk. I was watching a video of theirs. Um, I think it was the day. And they were talking about my man, Hank Johnson, who now sent out a little email asking his supporters to help him because that mean old Diamond and Silk bullying him. And they got all the support of the president and stuff like that. And just little old me was trying to do my job. Is it your job, Hank Johnson, to be supposedly represent the people because see we pay your salary you supposed to be representing the people but yet when the people came to to congress to talk about what was going on you sided with the big corporations you made it seem like man these people we we, we taking out time of our busy schedule to deal with these girls all they trying to do is pimp the system all they doing is they game in the system you know why you did that hank you did that because you want to undermine them because they don't support your party. See, you went and straight up sold them right down the drain and tried to protect the big corporations. But really what you were trying to protect is the Democratic Party and the narrative that they are always for black people. And most black people support them. And if they don't, then they must be crooked. They must be underhand. They must be up to something. Instead of giving them the benefit of the doubt, Hank. You decided to try to throw stuff out there to put them in the pickle. And in all fairness, in all fairness, Hank, you weren't the only one. There were all the rest of the other uh, black Congress people and senators, whoever they were, you know, uh, that was questioning them, did the same thing. And you know what burns me up about that? One of them had the nerve to remind them that I want to remind you that you are uh, sworn in and, uh, you know, lying to Congress is punishable. And I'm saying, yeah, you asking questions to try to trip them up, double trap them and, and, and catch them in some type of lie. You are willing to manipulate and try to ruin their lives. Now, I ain't talking to them. We see what happens when you quote unquote lie. Look at all the people they've been locking up lately for lying, except for Hillary. We don't want to. No, we don't want her. Her and her whole crew. We don't. No, they, they, they go for it. Here's a here's a hall pass. Go. Just go. Just go. Hurry up. I got you. I got you. That's what they do for Hillary. You know what I'm saying? But everybody else, you know, we can't, you know. So my point is they were willing to try to put them in a predicament and try to make them appear as if they were lying, knowing that they could have gotten prosecuted, they could, lives could have got ruined, all of that. All in efforts to protect who? Facebook? No, I don't think it was just to protect Facebook. You know, I think it was to protect the image of the Democratic Party because Diamond and Silk was exposing them. And you know what you did, Hank? You confirmed that the Democratic Party isn't really concerned about representing the black people or uh, you as a black man. You're not concerned about race or, or representing uh, and standing up for the brothers. You're more interested in standing up for the Democratic Party and also for yourself. That's what it comes down to because guess what? As long as y'all keep pushing all of this rhetoric all of the, the garbage, all of the fake narratives, and all of the race baiting, it keeps you in business. And soon as black people wake up and realize, whoa, 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 wait a minute, man. Stuff ain't like you've been saying it is. You know, you, you manipulate dipping us. That's what you're doing. So you can stay in power and have something to run on. Yeah, if we wake up to that, guess what? Bye-bye, Hank. Then you got to actually do your job. You got to think about what you're going to tell everybody to make them vote for you instead of just saying, guess what? Everybody's a racist, sexist, and we're not. That's your whole platform. So if you want to blame somebody, don't point the finger, point the thumb, Hank. That's who you need to point the, the finger at right there, the thumb, right at yourself, okay? And even if you do point the finger, there's four other fingers pointing right back at you. You dig it? So 
If you are one of those people who received the email of him crying out, please help me. I'm in trouble. They, they messing with me, y'all. I went and picked a fight, but I didn't know that I was going to get jumped. And now I'm getting... It, they, they jumping me. Somebody come to my rescue. Don't help Hank. Don't do it. Matter of fact, all three of those black uh, politicians that were trying to uh, attack Diamond and Silk for whatever reason, I guess they just love Facebook, you know. But uh, for all three of them, just like Diamond and Silk said, vote they tails out. Out. The big foot. Kick them out. Out. And when they're trying to talk, don't even listen. Just keep shaking your head and point your hand. Mm -mm, mm -mm, out. But see, I was, I was just trying to, I was doing my job. Mm -mm, mm -mm, mm -mm. Out. Keep going. Go. That's what needs to happen to them. Anyway, you've been listening to Kevin and Kevin's Corner. I love when they do stuff like that and give me material. <coughs> it's hilarious. All right. So if you like this video, hit like, share it. Also, uh, make sure you hit the notification button. Because uh, sometimes people say, man, I ain't get it. I ain't get it. And I want to thank everybody for supporting Kevin's Corner in every area possible, man. Y'all been sharing my videos on Twitter. People have been donating to Kevin's Corner. Um, I really, really appreciate that. Um, there are links in the bottom to do that. You can find me on Twitter. You can find me on Facebook. I also have a Minorities for Trump page. You can uh, request to be a part of. And we're really just trying to make this thing happen and keep exposing the Democrats and the funky, dirty, nasty, crusty, poop-stained, poop-smelling, little tinge of vomit in your throat, dirty, nasty, funky, liberal media. That's what we like doing. All right. God bless you. See you next time in Kevin's Corner.